Tesla Semi Pros and Cons With the goal of creating eco-friendly transport, Tesla Inc. came out with their latest prototype of an all-electric battery power class 8 Semi truck. The Tesla Semi was unveiled way back in the year 2017 at an event and showed great promise toward Tesla's original goal of freeing the economy from the use of fossil fuels. However, it has raised some concerns and criticisms regarding its features and working. The high-tech electric semi-truck has been an object of speculation and journalists and various websites have written a lot about the truck. While it's true that the Tesla semi-truck may have some cons, but it does have other features that provided a significant edge over its competitors. Pros Cost Effectiveness the base price of the Tesla Semi Truck is estimated to be about 150,000 US dollars, which is a $30,000 difference from the average diesel truck price of $120,000. Now, this may seem like a big difference, but when considering other factors, the Semi Truck comes out on top. Fuel costs, for one, are way more than a diesel truck than a battery powered truck due to the simple fact that electricity costs less than diesel. A diesel truck consumes $1.51 worth of fuel per mile on average, while the Tesla Semi Truck would take up to $1.26 of fuel per mile. Considering that an average truck travels about 50,000 miles every year, a Tesla Semi Truck owner would be saving $12,500 per year in fuel costs alone. Maintenance costs for the Tesla Semi Truck are also expected to be 50% less than their diesel powered counterparts. So combining that with the low cost of fuel consumption, we can expect massive savings. Great design and safety. Although the exterior design is arguably worse than that of many diesel trucks, and it has got a lot of criticism from people and journalists, we still believe that the Tesla Semi Truck looks futuristic and cool. The streamlined shape and smooth lines make for an aerodynamic model which Musk claims to be better than a supercar. Helping the truck with achieving fast acceleration, the truck is designed in a way that the battery packs will go under the truck, giving it a low center of gravity, providing rollover protection and much smoother turnings. Tesla describes it as the safest, most comfortable truck ever. It is noted that the glass of the Tesla Semi Truck is not any ordinary glass. It's a special reinforced glass with increased durability characteristics. Theoretically, the glass should remain intact even after being hit by a stone ejected from under the wheels of another car. The interior of the truck has enough space for a person to stand without bumping his head. The driver's seat is placed in the center for a better view and has two screens placed on each side displaying necessary info while the steering wheel sits between them. The autopilot sensors are great at avoiding collisions. Fast acceleration. The Tesla Semi comes with four independent motors powered by the battery cells. They are a most crucial part of the design, along with the electric powertrain that give the truck the ability to achieve a maximum of 60 miles per hour acceleration in just 20 seconds, with an 80,000 pounds of load up to 5 seconds without a trailer. Even at full capacity, while a diesel truck would take much longer to achieve full speed, this would help with a lot of traffic problems related to trucks. Now mention electric battery powered motors don't make a lot of noise, so that's another plus. Cons Shorter range One thing that cannot be ignored is the relatively shorter range that of the Tesla semi truck can manage on a single charge. An average diesel fuel semi truck could easily cover over a thousand miles on a full tank. The Tesla semi truck on the other hand has a set range of 500 to 600 miles according to recent interviews. It cannot compete with other semi trucks when it comes to long hauls and Musk himself said that the Tesla semi truck was mainly intended to be used for local deliveries. Slower charging Waiting for 30 minutes to charge your vehicle is not very desirable for most truck owners. Tesla is working on creating a network of mega charging stations for their trucks so that it's easier to charge them on the go. But the traditional diesel trucks still refuel much faster than their electric counterpart, which would be preferred by some of the truck drivers as they're paid by the mile. In 30 minutes, a semi would recover its 500 mile range 
while a diesel truck would be able to recover its full range much faster than that, saving more time. Not suitable for all weathers. It's also been said that the electric vehicles aren't suitable for driving in extreme temperatures such as cold. With internal heaters trying to keep the engine from freezing over, the range of the vehicle decreases due to all the extra interior work going on. So drivers have to be more considerate when operating these trucks in extreme climates. This could prove to be a disadvantage for truck owners hoping to cover more range and would incline them to go for a traditional option. This isn't that big of an issue, however, because in the long run, once the heaters have done their job, they take up less energy and thus range isn't affected too much, but it's still something to consider.